Jerry Snow denying the fact that Nigeria is blessed with a plethora of sporting talents, discovering and nurturing them, especially at the grassroots, remains a challenge. Table tennis is one area where the nation is still struggling, but the story is changing in Kogi West, where philanthropist Richard Osasi, through his annual tennis competition, is on 18 talented tennis players. This year's final was held on 25 December at Okuru in the Jumud local government area. Present to witness the occasion where the Speaker of Kogi State House of Assembly, Prince Matthew Kolawole, the Chairman of the local government, Taufik Isa and other government functionaries. And he's contributing his own quota to the development of sports and the youth in Kogi State. And sports cannot be left alone to the masses of the government to develop. So you need individual come to the aid of the government, aid of the youth to develop sports. Exactly that is what Osashi is doing right now. Be here today. See what is happening here today. This guy has started this thing for long. And you can see where it has reached now. We thank God Almighty. The youth. Anything we can do to bring you together, to discover talent about them, to see how we can push them to be a better, a better citizens, those are my motivation. Why we decided to start this tournament, and this is the second edition, and then we are, we, and we are, almost all the people who came to play finals are professionals. As you can see, it has brought happiness to people. That is, People are happy, we are together, and they were celebrating the, the death of our Lord, uh, the, uh, the birth of our Lord Jesus Christ. Ten players contested in the final rounds of this year's competition. Arif Mohorum Fola from Yagba West came fourth. Alabadari from Yagba East came third. In the final, Tada Samuel from Kaba and Kayode Emmanuel from Ijumu slugged it out. The former won 11-8 in the first game and 11-7 in the second. It was an improvement. It was an improvement from what we had last last year. Most of the stars, especially the final list, the first and the second position, we believe that they are capable to represent this state, and we are planning to project them and make sure that they stand and um, continue to perform very well in their respective uh, this uh, training. I don't even expect it in my life. There will be a champion today. But I thank God and I thank Osama Seyi for the competition that is due for everybody here. So, Alabadare from Yaba East, aka Nice. nice. He will go home with a sum of. 150,000. <laughs> Mr. Kayode Emmanuel from Ijumu came second. He is going to part home with the sum of 300,000. Uh, for this second edition of a uh, late par Abraham Osasei table tennis tournament. The king of the table tennis tournament for the second edition is Mr. Dada Samuel from Kababono. He is going home tonight with his arm of 500,000. It's commendable and should be emulated by every son and daughter of Okula. It could be something in smoker, uh, swimming, and every other thing. Osase was recently appointed as the general manager, Kogiste Signet and Advertisement Agency. It's a state appointment, and I want to use this opportunity to thank uh, our governor, Governor yeah, It's a big privilege that I'm not going to disappoint him. I'll make sure we go. We eat the ground running, start to create jobs, get involved in infrastructures, and most importantly, raise good revenue. Raise good revenue for the government. So, well, that will raise revenue for government. Government will be able to achieve their new direction. His contribution towards the development of the society has earned him several accolades, with several groups giving him awards. Jonathan Majali, 
एन टी ए न्यूज